But tell me, Yagami. You've never killed someone before, have you? to the channel this is epic twin bros i don't know why every time i begin the intro now i see this microphone i get to look into it like a magic ball but last week was a very entertaining episode this has been a weekly episode of how series we've been doing on the channel same like game of thrones we've been trying to make that weekly as possible but last week i remember her father luke I am your do do do. I don't know, uh, but I remember seeing that, and I was like kind of like nervous about it. Like, are they, are they gonna find, pull it in? Are they really gonna try to kill him? So, let's and not beat around the bush, and let's go into the video. Oh, you know what are you doing here? Quit following me! I want my no bark. Damn, guess I shouldn't be surprised. Look, I told you, stop following me! Then give me back my no bark. I don't know where it is! It's like a school for gifted children, but here's the crazy part. Its real purpose is to groom these kids so that one of them could become the next L. L successor? Apparently, the one most likely to succeed L is this kid named Nier. Nier? Is that N? Also, we found some leads on Mello, the one N mentioned. He's smart too, but he always came second to Nier. This guy is definitely the same Mello that N told us about. These are sketches of both of them. We couldn't find any photographs. L's successors. It looks like I'm still fighting L after all this time. They have him listed as Jack Nalon, but his real name is Cal Snyder. He's got the notebook. After that, it was a simple matter of using the death note to make Snyder send a letter to me with the location of the gang's hideout. It should be arriving soon. Highlight! Great news! The letter arrived! He's in L.A. I did it. I outmaneuvered both Nier and Mello. Guess... <laughs> Tag, you're it. The, uh, the notebook just flew. <laughs> it's a notebook that kills people. Hell, nothing surprises me anymore. <laughs> Boss, who is this? The guy in the freaky costume, who the hell is he? Who brought him here? I came here on my own. I'm actually a Shinigami. <laughs> Please, everyone touch it. I swear I'm not crazy. Whatever. Come on, guys. Touch the notebook. What? He the wasn't there the last time I touched it. Just, should I kill him? Nice try. You humans can't kill a Shinigami. <sighs> As of now, I'm going to forfeit ownership of this notebook. All I ask is that you agree to follow whichever person I give it to. What? You're giving up ownership again? But wait, won't you lose all your memories if you do that? Misa, lend me your notebook. Hmm. I'll keep it on me like this. That way, even if I forfeit ownership of my notebook, I won't lose my memory. I'll give you as many pages as you need. From this moment on, you're going to be Kira. Can you do that? Well, of course, but... Until then, we'll die. Are you saying those two rules are made up? Well, oh yeah, those rules are definitely fake. My guess is some Shinigami wrote those down as a joke before giving the notebook to a human. And if so, was he aware that these two rules were false? If he did know, he could have used these rules to his advantage. Go outside and keep watch, got it? What's with this guy? He's human, but he's scary. that you are the real Kira. Prove it? Now that there are others using the notebook, there's no point in predicting killings in order to identify myself. They could just as easily kill the same targets. 
But don't worry, I've already taken this into account. On November 10th, at exactly 11.59 p.m., arrangements have been made so that all known associates of the Mafia will die. <laughs> it's already been written in my notebook. That moment is your best and only chance to get the notebook back. It's up to you. I Ide, I think we both know what needs to be done. We get the Shinigami to follow us in, and then we do the deal for the eyes and make sure they're all dead, right? I will make the deal for the eyes. <sighs> no way, Chief! Let me be the one to do it! I was responsible for handing over the notebook in the first place. Since that moment, I've been unable to live with what I've done. I've even thought of killing myself. I'll use the notebook to kill any criminals who try to stop us. Report. Is everybody ready to move in? Roger. Roger. Right, Ryuk. I'm ready. Sure thing, boss. That's going on. That's so cool. Once you're finished, I want you to take a look at the photographs of the criminals I gave you. Can you see their names and lifespans? Yes, I can. Their names should disappear soon. That's your cue. Everyone, move in! I didn't think you'd go this far. My plan was supposed to be perfect. Damn! What the hell is Sido doing? Relax, Sido. Just shut up and watch, all right? All you have to do is sit here and do nothing. If you can do that, you'll get your notebook back. Don't move! Elle, we've apprehended two of the criminals. We've also been able to secure the notebook. We've come this far. Let's finish this. Do a thorough search. What was that? An explosion! Don't move! I've already blown up the two entrances to this place. This will be your only warning. The next explosion will take out the entire building, as well as all your men inside. So you better do as I say. It's mellow. You're me again, huh? Maybe I should have killed you when I had the chance. With you again. M-I-H-A-E-L-K-E-E-H-L -E -E Your real name, it's Mihail Kale. What the hell? How did he... I did it. It's over, Mello. It's time to turn yourself in. If you give up, I won't kill you. You have my word on that. What are you doing? Don't be stupid! Write his name down and kill him now! You know how this works. I write your name, and you will die. Let go of that trigger and put your hands in the air. But tell me, Yagami. You've never killed someone before, have you? Come on, please. 
Please, Dad, you can't die on me like this! Light. Yeah, Dad? Light. I still have them. I still have the Shinigami eyes. According to that Shinigami Ryuk, I can't see the lifespan of someone who owns a notebook, but I can see the numbers above your head. Light. You really aren't Kira. I'm so glad. My son. Don't tell me you're still worried about that, Chief. Uh, of course he's not Kira. Come on. You shouldn't talk so much, Dad. In the end, I couldn't do it. I couldn't bring myself to kill him. I can't just come out and say it's not too late. No. Wait, maybe I can. It all depends on how I do it. No one will think it's weird if I get upset and panic. Come on. Dad, write his name. You can't let him beat you like this. Write his name down. With your last bit of strength, do you want to die in vain? D Dad, no. to the discussion part of the video and eh? I'm not calm. The the these right here they're not tills man that like pss, that like piss. Pss, sh, I don't know what you're talking about. Pss, I don't, don't call it's just, like cartoons. Pss, what, do, pss, what, you, pss, what do you mean? I need about five more minutes to digest this god damn what an episode. I knew by the name of it, it had me shook in. I forgot about it halfway through, and then. Fuck you, Mellow. And. And, fuck you, like, because. You, you know, I ain't gonna care about he died. It, that, that, to me, it feel like he didn't care that his, his own fault died. That, so messed up in so many ways. And remember. So he'll want to tell us a piss. Uh, let me see what I wrote down. School for the gifted. Uh, that they grow. They, I thought it was just on a regular orphanage. Just uh, that when they attach to me, uh, I can't pronounce her name. Still out so many damn episodes. Uh, that he funded basically. Uh, and that that put could see like like he he funded a lot a lot of uh, shit and that. Pretty cool in my opinion. Uh, also, let me see. Light new plan. Uh, and we saw, we saw it went down. It just didn't pan out all the way like how he wanted to. He thought he was about to get the upper hand like he did on L a couple episodes back. But it cool, it, it bad and cool at the same time. You see, mellow, uh, get away. Somehow he got away. I can, I can understand how he got away because he had his own little bomb and he probably knew the right place to like work all go to make sure he didn't get hooked at all. But now, well, he, he probably is hooked, but probably not that bad. Uh, and still, fuck you, mellow, and fuck you, Neil. I like Neil a little bit more. Didn't see him really that much on this episode, but I'm sure that about to sh change. Sido, the uh. Uh, Shimigami. During the reaction, I said I want to see like a, a fight between uh, Baruch and him, but I guess we're gonna be seeing that anytime soon. I'm fine with that, but I'd like to see a beef between them two. See what'll happen. And Sido called Sido called uh, Melo a uh, he's he's scary, and then all 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 four of them was shooting at him just a while ago for being looking so damn scary. So I don't think he got anything to talk about. Uh, but Sido was an interesting character to watch. Uh, and he stayed his place not too long and not too short. Uh, and now they get to the uh, the meat, the 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 dinner, the supple of the episode. And fucking, even even though he died, but 
the chief. He got the damn ass, and that shit was too cool. I remember a uh, while back, uh, the chief uh, ro uh, rolled a bus through uh, the production, the, P the TV station, and that shit was just so good. And then now he coming back again with this. It's so freaking cool. Uh, them eyes made him look like a badass. And then at the end of the episode, he looking, phase, turn hair, close his eyes, and that. That was uh, that, that was too much. And uh, when, when I saw the explosion, what metal caused, I legit was thinking, oh no, they killed the entire task force. Well, I can remember this episode, but I think last episode I could not remember the task force. At least uh, there still be a couple of them, maybe all of them, I don't know. Like, probably could, hopefully a couple of them there, just so it don't look weird. Like, if they won't make this like a Game of Thrones episode, I ain't gonna spoil you on what episode it was, but a whole lot of motherfuckers there. And, and that happened like two, three times on the show, and it was the the last one that happened, if I'm not mistaken. Michael Kiha, and that's 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 a real name, like Michael, really. And then they up an accent, real. Well, I'm pretty sure it's probably Michael, but uh, I'm pretty sure the Japanese probably got a different way of pronouncing it. It looked like Michael to me. Uh, Don it said Matsuda, maybe he lived, like he maybe he didn't get too hot. And if I'm guessing then how the show goes, they they don't kill off anybody, they don't kill off they just kill off the chief this episode. And it seemed like it, it, it they should they should have waited a couple more episodes in my opinion. It's like flesh it out, man. I I'm hoping that somehow the Chiefs became the uh became the hero at the end of this, like the ultimate yeah. yeah. They, 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 they told me that uh, there are no heroes on the show. They're like you can pick which side you wanna be on. I don't want to be on nobody's side right now. I really don't. And remember, there wasn't tears that would piss. Don't forget that. Uh, the chief dies. I uh, like. That was, that, was, that was legit too much. Uh, the L episode were what we call heartbreaking. But now, like, I can cry and not be what we call so dead inside. It feels like. Uh, I'm sad that he died. He was legit. It, him, Matsuda. Probably L than like in my top fa top five. I don't know who's five yet. God dang, me so looking so damn fine. I wanna wonder if I could find like a set stars. I mean, uh, I wonder if I could find some Wi-Fi passwords. Could go find whole news online. Me, it's a cartoon, so I can't be thinking about that. I know what I'm doing tonight. I'm going to do research for people for college. I don't go to college. Okay, now that we're going down the rabbit hole, but, uh, it's such a good episode, you and this, it is how the rest of the episode gonna feel like, I'm ready for this, uh, I said that a couple episodes back, uh, before Elle died, and I was like, it, uh, like, like, two, three episodes, like, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, like, it, it was like so, so many damn good episodes, so, I don't know what to expect the more from the show. I, I probably said this that same line probably twenty times in the twenty eight episodes, and I probably say that twenty times during this whole series. I do not know what to expect. I really don't. We really see Mello, Neil, and Dow conclusion. I hope one of them, both of them, all of them. I don't care. Dies. Now this is my prediction. This is my bold prediction. And don't you fans laugh? Don't you make fun of me? Kind of make fun of a lot about the show. But, uh, I think Matsuda, he'll become the how real how superhero on the show. He'll become the gig guy at the end of this. He'll end everybody like Because Matsuda is the god of the show. He's my favorite character now. And to give the chief justice, I think that the next episode, we're not trying to make a pun at all, but hopefully Matsuda give Melo some justice. And ain't that like a analogy? Pal justice? Pat, Justice for Pat. I don't know, I can't down the analogy, so make sure I don't look like a dumbass. Uh, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more content from us. Like I said, it's been a weekly episodic show, and I can't wait to get to the last bits and pieces of it. Uh, thanks for watching the video. Uh, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, like I just said. Check out the Patreon if you might get a couple more. Who knows for our channel? Make it get like a new series up because I would really like to do it once in a while. Put like a 
five episodes of a new series we put it up on now and we let the fans just like uh, binge watch it with us as we watching it and we usually say what content but this was a great sci-fi episode it felt like I oh, was watching a 20 minute episode of Game of Thrones of Westworld and I'm ready for more I hope y'all come on come with me with this journey and the first time you watch it well couldn't see you here uh, and you've been you've done watch the show 20 times it could see people here because they, they, they just want to watch my reaction and y'all got a damn good version of it remember fans I always says like four times those were not tills those they're tills peace